Kevin. Screaming Kips, thanks for the three months. Of the Dead Space speedruns, Ben, they're good. I'm like four minutes off the record. Probably gonna do some more attempts later today. I just thought I would try to, uh... Oh, I thought I'd just do something different to start the stream for a change. Well, I'm glad I'm, I'm glad the stream can help my stomach. You discovered a new skip. Uh, yeah, I know. Well, unless there was another new one. There's like a setup for the new skip though that looks it looks relatively consistent. Well, the new skip only saves like 10 seconds. I, w I probably wouldn't even bother with it. Hello, Feist Young. Hey, Rophilus. Thanks for the 20 months. Jib, thank you for the 20 months, dude. Can you cast this to your TV? Maybe if you have, like... Yeah, pro probably, I don't know. You can just download the Twitch app on the TV, if it's, like, a smart TV, and just watch that way. my TV just has issues, but the Twitch app on my LG TV is pretty bad. Not gonna lie. Drag a 5 you meter HDMI cable through your house. I like yeah. it. A VZZL, thank you for the two months. Roku blocks the Twitch app? What? Yeah, Twitch is on all the consoles, at least. Well. Last gen and current gen, anyways. Alright, so we have a character. Dis T. And 
I bought the burial blade. Stranger, so I'm probably going to do stranger, burial stranger. blade, I think, for this. Only plus nine, but... So yeah, we're just going to go... I don't know if I should bother doing the chalices. Like, I kind of want to do them. No game. Oh. Like, I could get better gems if I do the chalices, but... I don't know if I should bother. I mean, chalices persist through energy cycles. Is something wrong with the game audio? Too loud? It's guff? Crunchy? Okay, hold on a second. Hold on, I need to get to a safe spot. Welcome home, Ashen One. Oh wait, what about now? Still? Oh my god. Alright. I gotta kill this guy once more. Overdriving? I don't even know what that means. Uh... What about now? Any better? Yo, what's up, Fox? Hey, Angela. Good morning. See if I remember how to do these chalices. And I like I kinda wanted I don't know, what do you guys think? Should I do the chalices? I could get some pretty good gems if I do the chalices, but this isn't where I want to be. But yeah, I'm trying to speedrun them. I should probably open up, like, the speedrun guide, though, because I'm already going the wrong way. Honestly, dude, where the fuck am I right now? I'm so lost right now. What? Was I actually supposed to open that chest? Oh, no, here it is. I think I do need to pick up that. I think there's ritual blood in that chest. What are you gonna do with the chalices, Sharon? Oh god. I just get so lost. It doesn't seem right. I actually don't think I'm supposed to do this. But yeah, I could get gems from the Winter Lanterns near Orphan. They're not quite as good, but it would probably be way more. 
It'd certainly be faster. Dude, why am I so confused? Oh, no. Yeah, I was thinking about trying New World, but... I don't think many people would be interested in watching me play that. That charged our two is very good against these guys. Twitch TV app sucks. Yeah, that that was my issue as well. On my TV, like the app constantly froze and had issues and stuff. I thought it was maybe just my TV, but maybe just the app sucks. The Twitch app on PS4 is fine. Whoa. Alright, I'm just opening up the speedrun notes for this. What new game is this? It's New Game Plus, like the title says. Watch my Kendo mod video. Oh, nice. Yeah, that was a fun mod. Pretty well done. Being able to just knock these dudes over is so nice. Yeah, this gate is like really far away, isn't it? I guess we're running all the way back. Fuck it. Uh, no, I don't think there's any level range. I don't know. Somebody who's, like, a bit more knowledgeable might be able to correct me. I haven't done too much, like, multiplayer, but... I think anybody can join. But I'm not actually 100% sure. Like, can you... Can you join somebody in NG plus six if you're just in new game? Is that even possible? Yes. Okay. Well then it's fine. Although people are probably just gonna get fucking shit on. Most likely. Somebody's gonna join on their like level 50 character. Get one shot. <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna I'm gonna end up being so high level by the end of this that I'll. I'll probably be higher than everybody who joins, or like most people, if I had to guess. I've done the BL4 chalices. 
quite a challenge. Honestly, dude. I'm so lost. I'm just gonna use Bolt Hunter's Mark. I need to buy more of these. Yeah, Defiled Watchdog took me quite a while. I actually think I got... When I did that BL4 run, I think I killed... Um, I killed the Keeper of the Old Lords pretty quickly. Why not Cam on? I don't want Cam on. Oh my god, that did so much damage. 1800, holy moly. Because I broke his head. Do I do co-op? Not today. A long raccoon, thanks for the 36 months. Yeah, I did a no-hit run of Bloodborne. It's on my YouTube channel. I'm not a big fan of no-hit, though, to be honest. It's not even that hard, it's just like... It's just really not that fun. <laughs> Glass is having sub one paces. Yeah, I mean, I saw he's like two or three seconds off, so. Pretty insane. But like, I could no hit all of the Souls games any percent in like a few days of trying. It's just. I just like mauled. Yeah, I mean, I tried to no-hit Sekiro. I was doing it for like three or four days. And then... I like fell off a ledge on... I, I, I finished a no-hit run of Sekiro, but like I fell off a ledge at one point. So like it wasn't through no-hit. Well, I wasn't really having very much fun with no hit month, so I stopped it. These guys. That's fine, honestly, just... I don't know. No hit, it just... I, I just came to realize it's not for me. Like, I wanted to give it a try, and I did for a little bit, but it just... I don't know. It's just not for me. Hey, okay, all comes to an end. Thanks for the nine months. This is just NG+. Plus. Like the title says. This thing actually has, like, crazy range. Uh, 
I love the burial blade. I'm excited for the NG plus six chalice run, er, ch chalice run. NG plus six viewer run. I don't even know, like, you think we're even gonna be able to finish it? I think we will, right? I don't know, man. It's gonna be really hard. I mean, I've had viewer runs take like six. I feel like I've had viewer runs take like six to eight hours in new game. Well, it depends. Most of the time, I think like generally it's like four or five. When I do it in new game. get their 99 vitality characters yeah i mean if somebody comes in with a lot of health and like all the hp boost ruins they might be in pretty decent shape Poisoned. You missed the hot tub stream? No, I did it a while ago. So turned around. Got a plus five on my own, yep. That's yeah, just a plan. Didn't even bother using pellets. Yeah, Chalice Dungeons are always the same difficulty no matter what.
else is in this room anyways? Is there any other chests? Tomb mold. Sage's wrist. Bunch of garbage. Gruber. Man, I just love the chalice dungeons. Yeah, I figured I might as well g get like a character in NG plus with the chalice dungeons done. In case I ever want to do like NG plus meme run or something. Um, I mean, I can always just like save edit too, I guess. But... It's fine. I farm gems. I'm tempted to get to go for a few good gems, but it might take a while. I don't know. I like the later chalices. Or like I like I like the bosses and stuff, but collecting materials is pretty annoying. At least there's like the hacked chalices. That's kind of nice. You can't use paper out. Be so sick if you could use. Right, right up the butt. Yeah, this guy is super annoying. <laughs> Nice gesture. I remember when I missed getting the record in Bloodborne by like a second because I got a gesture when I was on the way to talk to Garman. Good times. How much did you miss not doing any Chalice Dungeons? Uh, you didn't miss too much, I would say. Try quick online way to unlock FRC Chalices. Yeah, I know, I know that there's like... There's like the... I, I can go straight to like the Yarnum Queen, right? I think. I think you can just go straight to Yarnum Queen with the hack Chalices. Uh, but yeah, you- I wouldn't say you missed too much, Ray. I mean, the chalices are a decent amount of content, but it's kind of repetitive. But there are, like, unique bosses in the chalices. Yeah, getting to the boss is kind of annoying. favorite part of Bloodborne. Insane. Uh, 
I definitely won't say that this is my favorite part of Bloodborne, but... I mean, extra content is always, like, a good thing. Don't do it. Hey, thank you for the eight months, Savage. And Gondosos, thanks for the six months. Thank you, buddy. Yeah, and it's definitely, it's, I'd say the chalices are some of, like, the hardest content in the game. I mean, the DLCs and chalices, like, the late game chalices are definitely, like, the hardest. Oh my god, I'm, I'm about to die to this guy. Can I still knock them over? Blobs do so much damage. Also, I'm sorry I missed I think I missed a few resubs. Uh Long Raccoon, thank you for the three years, and all comes to an end. Thank you for the nine months. Also, Scotty, thank you for the four. And uh Alessio, thank you for the five months. It's weird, it says okay, wait, wait, hold on. Yeah, it says to hug to the left to avoid the slime, which is true. But the rat was in my way. I wasn't really looking close. Oh my god, what the... Too many enemies. The new Bloodborne skipper, are you talking about the pellet pickup? Yeah, I was there when he was testing it at first. I'm actually surprised it, it took that long to figure something like that out. To be honest, I didn't even... I didn't even realize you could drop onto the pellets... ...from that area. <laughs> Not gonna lie. The skip isn't really anything that crazy, but... ...you... There's like eight beast blood pellets in old Yarnum. Um, there's like eight beast blood pellets in old Yarnum, and you can skip like running down the alleyway to pick them up by like you can like drop onto a bag and then like pick them up that way. It's kind of hard to explain.
Yeah, I think it's... How much time does it save? Like, 10 seconds? 8 seconds? Yeah, I've done the false step chalices. Well, a few of them. But yeah, I gotta kill these guys. Ritual blood. This weapon is so good. Dang it. We need to get a ritual blood drop from one of these bagmen. I'm gonna try to headshot him. Is it possible to headshot him? I don't know what I'm hitting right now. Whoa there. If you hit that enemy and it's like... I mean, it's like a... Guys, hitbox is bugged. It's okay. You just... His, like, spin attack is super fucked up, though. He has ass pimple. Uh, it does so much damage, though. I mean, I've done these chalices so many times, but I can never remember, like, exactly where to go. It's awful. Is online required to get all chalice dungeon items? You can't really get... I don't really...
really know what you mean by that. Can't really get all the items in the chalice dungeons. Anyways. Hello, hostess. Yeah, I need more channel point stuff, I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, we gotta get a ritual blood here from this asshole. Thank you for the prime sub, man. Yeah, Bloodborne actually only goes up to NG plus six. But yeah, we're gonna try to get to max difficulty. Not, we're not gonna get all the way there today, but it's so weird that that hits you from behind. What? Does the R2 use up my entire stam bar? It does. Holy shit. Charger R2 uses so much stamina. <laughs> Alright, I don't even have base. Well, I have eight I do have eight endurance. I have 15% extra stam the rune, but. Come on. Stop dropping twin shards, damn it. Yeah, I've seen so many streamers playing that new world game. I haven't really watched at all, but. I was like tempted to play it. Yeah, I mean, I'm not saying it's bad. I just don't think very many... I mean, I, it's not like I only play games, like... I don't I don't think very many of my viewers are interested in watching me play, like, an MMO. <laughs> That's all. Yeah, yeah, I know, Black Moses. I'm just... I'm just clarifying. I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure a spider just jumped. They just did... That was like six attacks in a row. Marred and boosting with mage streams. We watched you play WoW. I mean... Some people did. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, maybe I'll try it, but we'll see. Miss me getting no loot at all during raid nights? Yeah. Good times. Yeah. I'm glad I'm done with WoW. I got to like level 66 or 67 in, B in BC, but then I was just like... I don't know. This wasn't really... Wasn't really feeling it. Dude, what is... They're all spamming the most OP attack ever.
way too many spiders around here. fighting Rom because of the spiders. <laughs> I mean, if you kill the spiders, it's fine. Those spiders are more dangerous than the boss. Because <laughs> there's so many of them. The headbutt dive, well, the headbutt dive does a decent amount of damage, but the worst attack is actually the double jump. They do like a baby jump and then like a big jump afterwards. That fucking attack is so fucking strong. It will one shot you with like 20 vit or like 30 vit. I don't know why it does so much damage. Platinum a couple weeks ago. Oh, nice. Congrats, dude. I played through all of Blasphemous, including the DLCs. I was actually... I can't even remember. I think I was sponsored to play Blasphemous, or... I actually can't remember. I can't remember if it was a sponsor or if they just sent me a key, but I think they were spo they sponsored the stream for the DLC release. It was pretty hype. Yeah, it's a fun game. At least you missed. Are you playing New World? Uh, first some more cheeky. Okay. No, I mean, I'm gonna be doing the main game as well. I might actually go back to the main game after I finish this 
this chalice. I have the defiled chalices next, and my health is kind of low. I don't really know if I want to do them right now. <laughs> I mean, I definitely could. Kind of just being a peach. Could also maybe try to, like, get a gem or something. I have no idea how to dodge this punch attack. Guess you just gotta wait a bit longer. Spend two. Oh, look at that. Boom. Oh! Say, is he gonna fucking hit me with that? Is that a gra- oh god, I'm dead. I don't even know this guy can grab. <laughs> can you use cocktails on him? I don't know. Maybe? I think I might be out of vials. Oh no, I do. Yeah, he like bit my head off. Is wait, is there a bloodletting beast in the defiled chalice? Oh my god. I just want my soul. Insane right now. I really need a pellet. Hey, Luca. the grab. I dodged it though. You fuck. is rough. Where am I in the main game? Uh, the Hunter's Dream. <laughs> hey, Lark.
Is this the viewer run? Nope. Welcome. What? Very well. Farewell. <laughs> Get one more level. Welcome. What? No hunter's dream Very run. <laughs> All right. I need to get my health and stam up a bit more, but there's no source, guys. He is. I'm not gonna say he's trolling, cause maybe he believes it, but. Is no confirmation of any of these things. There's a lot of speculation. Alright. It's a 4chan leak. Oh boy. This is so... <laughs> there is literally no way. This... <laughs> Guys, there's gonna be a cosmic revolver. A double barrel shotgun. <laughs> Sounds pretty legit. <laughs> oh. Oh. It will be in the new DLC. <laughs> yeah. What's up, Marchie? Okay, uh, we're gonna take a break from the chalices for a little bit and just do the main game. Um, I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go use the restroom though. I will be back in a sec. Okay. I'm back. Just one sec.
Yeah, Gilbert's a G. Alright, Gascoigne, I'm coming for your ass. I still need to figure out what day I want to do the viewer run. I mean, I need to get the character set up first, obviously. I don't know, probably in like a week or so. Doing it on a Sunday is probably a good idea. Been farming the cum chalice. Oh baby. Yeah, I can't wait for Elden Ring, dude. It's gonna be so, 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 so good. Oh, it's been so long. I'm probably gonna be playing Elden Ring like for like half a year straight. surprised <laughs> I don't know why I'm picking up bolt hunter marks for the rest of our lives only half a year well we'll see half a year is a long time my dude but considering considering I played re8 for two months and RE8 is insanely linear and has no, like, variety. Who knows? I mean, I could I could be playing Elden Ring for, like, be for the shop. ages. You'll be one of them, sooner or later. Yeah, I mean, Elden Ring could... Honestly, I'm I'm really curious, like, how... Uh... I'm wondering how quick the any percent run is going to be for Elden Ring. I know that I don't think you're going to be able to just like go straight to the final boss or anything like Breath of the Wild style, but it could end up being like I honestly wouldn't be surprised to see any percent be like five bosses. Like you basically just run or rush to the end of every like area because 
from from what I can tell, there's gonna be how, how many like domains did they say there's gonna be in Elden Ring? Because they were talking about like there's gonna be six. So at the very least, you're probably gonna have to kill seven bosses, assuming unless there's a way to skip whatever check there is, like. You know, maybe there's a fucking door. Maybe maybe it's like the kiln. Maybe there'll be like a kiln skip sort of thing, but... It's gonna be crazy. Like, the Souls games are just so... They're so... Uh, yeah, there's gonna be a tutorial boss too, that's true. Or most likely. Yeah, I'm just... I'm just so excited. The Souls games have so much... Like, the routing for the Souls games is so fun. Just figuring out... Figuring out how everything's laid out. The games are just so complex. Non-linear games are just so fun to... ...experiment and test with. Um... Whatever, I guess we're gonna grab these. I don't really need to, but... I don't think there's gonna be death cams in Elden Ring, to be honest. I mean, the thing is, some people are like, oh my god, like, it's just another Souls game. It's like, yeah, but that's... <laughs> is that a bad thing? <laughs> like, I love... I love... I, I don't know. I'm... I'm a fanboy, obviously, but... I mean, FromSoft obviously have, like, a formula, and they're very good at it. And every game they try... You know, they try new things. It's not like they... It's, it, it's an exact copy of the previous one. Each each game feels like unique enough, in my opinion. I mean, it's the first time we're gonna have mounts. <laughs> and we're gonna have summons as well. You know, I, I was wondering if, like, FromSoft saw the Pokemon Souls mod. I know this is far-fetched, but, like, <laughs> yeah, I almost wonder if they saw... If they saw that mod. Not that it's... not that they came up with the idea or anything, but... I mean, Elden Ring is... It's kind of like, you're going to be able to get all sorts of summons, so... That's, that's pretty new. I mean, summons aren't new for a Souls game, but... Being able to summon them on the fly is kind of different. Though, if you look at the... If you look at the trailer, apparently... Anytime summons are used, there's like this blue stone, like a, there, there's this stone thing, like an obelisk that you have to use to summon, I believe. So you're not, I don't think you're going to be able to just summon anywhere. I'm, I'm really curious to see. I mean, every Souls game has glitches and skips. Like, I just, I can't wait to see, especially with the the momentum and stuff and the movement in Elden Ring. I just, I, I can't wait to see what kind of crazy stuff there is in the game. This isn't going to work. <laughs> it's just completely, completely missed. I jumped way too late. What is his purpose? Just to give FromSoft, like, expert in extra inspiration, have, like, an outside influence, I guess.
Yeah, I know there was an interview with George recently where he said he said he hasn't like really been involved with the game for years at this point. Uh, he's writing like the he was writing like the mythos and stuff for the game. like the lore. I mean, he didn't write everything. I think it's more of like a, kind of like the background, or like the mythology of the game. Yeah, I can quit out up here and show you guys. So yeah, the new skip is like right here. I'm not gonna do the skip, but I can just show you. Hey Liara, thanks for the five months. And not that guy, Ryan. Thank you for the two. So basically up here, you can you can like walk over this ledge here, you see? And uh you can drop on so this is the beast blood pellets that I just picked up. You gotta, like, run all the way down here around the corner, right? But if you land on that bag and then do a charge dar 2 across the let, like, to the other bag, you basically, like, launch to the other bag and you pick up the pellets at the same time. And the bags don't count as, like, valid ground for a quit out because it's, like, an object. So, yeah, you can quit out on the bags and then you spawn back up here and you can just go straight to BSB. So you don't have to, like, run down to get the Beast Blood pellets. Basically. It's a... I, I don't actually know how much time it saves. I, but... Definitely a bit. I, I feel like it must be at least like, 100 seconds. Elden Ring quitouts are gonna be insane. I mean, who knows? Maybe they're gonna make it like Dark Souls 2 and just not even let you quit out in the air. Although, I think it's going to be more... Like, I think Dark Souls 2 is kind of an exception. I don't I don't know what was going on with that game. But, because, you know, it's, it's interesting, right? That, like, in Dark Souls 2, you could quit out. Or, in Dark Souls 1, you could quit out in the air and, like, doing stuff. And then in Dark Souls 2, they got rid of it. And then they brought it back for Dark Souls 3. But, but then, then they also got rid of it for Sekiro... So it's like, <laughs> who knows, I guess. <laughs> I mean, it's more of a Souls game, so it's prob you're probably going to be able to. game is super glitch heavy. Oh my god. I'm really missing. The game is super glitch heavy, but I'll probably do like glitch this category. Well, it even has double jumping from what we can tell. Or at least with the mount you can double jump. his walls are tall as fuck. I mean, yeah, who knows, though? Maybe, considering you can get, like... You can just spawn the mount. There might be a way to go out of bounds with, like, spawning the mount. I mean, who knows? The game... <laughs> it could be so broken. But, we just have to wait and see. I mean, maybe there will be a... It looks like there's gonna be a lot of magic in the game. Maybe there's gonna be a freaking tears glitch again. Who knows, dude? I'm just gonna be able to air walk, clip out of bounds. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Air swimming, yeah. Yeah, who knows. What if we get air walk spells? That would be, uh, that's a bit much for From Software. <laughs> You'd have to, like, build an entire game around that. I should be okay. Heal just in case. I have three items on, which don't. I think it would have been fine. If you have four weapons equipped, you actually die from fall damage when you drop down here. There's like a hidden equip load in this game. It's it barely affects your fall damage, but it does affect it slightly. Yeah, if you if you have four weapon, if you if you're fully equipped, you always die there without healing. Cause I was I was doing all achievement runs, and you pick up like the torch, so I would just equip it for fun, and then I started dying here. I was like, what the fuck is going on, dude? Cause yeah, you equip the Hunter's Axe to knock off Jura, and then... I was equipping the Torch for fun. Okay, KFC. I need to get a frickin' blood rock. I think I could go in the chalices to get one though, if I wanted. Are these... I was gonna say, I, I don't know if cold bloods are like any bigger in NG+, but they're not. Elden Ring on the Steam Deck. I haven't really looked at the specs of the Steam Deck. I've heard it's pretty good though. I mean, for a portable console, anyways. PS4, Xbox One, power-wise, but with 720p. Okay. Well, that's decent enough for some games. What Souls game has the best area designs? I mean, Dark Souls 1 has, like, the best... The best world, in my opinion, in terms of just variety and, like... Where you can go right from the beginning and stuff like that. Although you still do have to go through Sen's Fortress, like, no matter what, that's the only thing, but... but yeah, Dark Souls 1. Probably has the best world. Elden Ring might have the best, though, in, in the future. <laughs>
I need more freaking. Oh no, I lost the color. She would have been like fucking dead. I really need more stamina for this weapon. Okay, this is not. I just do not have enough right now. Is this weapon good? I mean, yeah, it's. It's pretty good. You have to hit her foot? I mean, if you hit her legs, you can make her stun like that. Twice. Master Willem, I've come to bid you farewell. Oh, I know, I know. You think now to betray me. I wonder if there's gonna no, be like a limb listen. system in the Elden Ring. I tell you I will not forget our adage. Because there's there's gotta be something that they have. We are born of the blood. Made men to, like, by the blood. To punish a boss. By the blood. Most likely. You don't I like. I like like I wonder if it's just gonna be uh just like fear, hitting the boss the enough staggers blood. them or if it's gonna be like Bloodborne where it's kind of like a limb a I limb system. I, leave. I mean there's a lot of arms and limbs in Elden Ring, so who knows? I mean it's not like every boss in Bloodborne works that way. A lot of them do. I mean, Amelia does, Parl, One Reborn, Lawrence. Yeah, Amygdala. Hey, Joker, thank you for the three months, man. Disappointment. I mean, I just, I don't see, <laughs> I really don't see how, like, anybody could think <laughs> that Elden Ring is going to be bad. I mean, they've released, like, six great games in a row. And Dark Souls 2 was pretty scuffed, but it was still very fun. <laughs> Where did I go for dinner? I went to like a Thai place. What everyone said about Cyberpunk, that's completely not true. What? what? <laughs> the only thing... <laughs> The only thing CD Projekt Red had going for them is Witcher 3. Alright, anyways, uh, let's... Let's level up a little bit. Welcome with... Very well then. Farewell. Hey, Z. I mean, the, the thing is that, yeah, the trailer showed so, so much different stuff, but I don't even think we, we, I think we saw a fraction of what is an Elden Ring, which is so, like, <laughs> uh, so crazy. I'm so, I'm so, uh, I'm so excited. Just, like, put me to sleep. Wake me, <laughs> wake, wake me up when fucking Elden Ring is here, dude. So Fitz, thank you for the seven months.
<laughs> I yeah, I've there's a lot of people who are like Cyberpunk was so hyped and look what happened, dude. Elden Ring's like dude, dude Elden Ring might be the same, it's like <laughs> Alright. Whatever you say, dude. Hope we get DLC for Elden Ring as well. I mean, they've released DLCs for every game except Sekiro, and it kind of makes sense that they didn't release one for Sekiro. I mean, they easily could have, but... but... Yeah, DLC would be awesome. Why does it make sense? Well, I don't know. Sekiro is just more of like... I don't know. It's more of like an action game, I guess. That's not to say that action games can't get DLC. I don't know. I never really went into Sekiro expecting a DLC. I like a Bloodborne remake for PS5 and PC. Nah, man, I love 30 FPS. I should learn how to do hut skip. I don't know why I'm bothering pick up picking up so many twin shards. I mean, I do kind of need to pick some up. Like, I'm, I don't want to just use the burial blade the whole time. Obviously, I'd like to use some other weapons down the line, so... Sony bought a studio that specializes in PC ports two weeks ago. Hmm. Well, who knows? DS3 Magic only run. Yeah, sorcery only in DS3 is pretty. It's pretty rough early on, like, but you can you can do. So it's it's funny, but it's a, it's actually better to leave Sage and Deacons for, like, super late. Like, when I would do Sorcery only in DS3, I would kill... I would kill Dan... I would kill, like, Watchers and Volmir. I would kill Watchers and Volmir and then go, go do, like, Dancer and, uh, Dragon Slayer armor. You can get a shit ton of souls. Then you can have, like, fucking... 50 or 60 in for Sage and Deacons. Just because those fights are so fucking annoying. Did I pick up this ruin before? Steam Deck could run Bloodborne better than a PS4.
Yeah, doing Sage early is just a bad idea. Plus ten weapon. This boss like pinwheel. Thank you, thank you for the nine months. <laughs> no, I don't have enough insight. Nice skill on the last shadow, thank you. Oh, like Pinwheel makes copies? No. Like that. Yeah, it's 60 insight. It's quite a lot. It's okay though. Plus nine is still all right. I just wish I had more stamina. shot these guys with the angel.
I got kind of lucky there. <laughs> Yeah, I can't wait to see the Moonlight Greatsword and, well, whatever Moonlight weapon they put in a Elden Ring. You know it's gonna be there. It's probably gonna be freaking sick as hell. Yeah, it would have been cool if there was something like that in Sekiro. Welcome with very well. I really need more health, but I just... I want endurance. <laughs> this weapon just uses so much. Hey, Shadow Raptor, thanks for the six months, man.
how does Hob do this part? I think he takes the teleporter. This is just NG+. Plus. Yeah, I'm playing on PS5. Can I go back? the build I'm using. I mean, this is just the burial blade. Also, I'm not fighting this guy. Fuck this guy. I 
died to that guy like twice the other day. That's an asshole. I don't even know why I'm unlocking that shortcut either. That <laughs> shortcut is so useless. Well, I mean, that. I guess it's good if you want to get a living string. It's probably the fastest way back to this area. No death, no bonfire, SL1 run. Uh, no. Can't say I have. Yo, Appleby, thank you for the 34 oh, months, man. Or some say oh, all right, I have some fried rice in the fridge. I think I'm gonna go heat that up after I kill Mikolash. I am pretty hungry right now. Oh. We shall not abandon the dream. Also, SCB, thank you for the 28 no months. No one can catch us. No one can stop us now. I tried to roll, but apparently it didn't go off. Or maybe, maybe he hit me like the frame I rolled and it counter hit me. I don't know. <laughs> I actually don't know. I mean, it does, it does a shit ton of damage on NG plus. So maybe, I mean, maybe it just, maybe it just one shots, even if it's not a counter hit. Are you able to bait him in the hall like that? If you shoot him... If you shoot him like three times... He'll, uh... He'll aggro to you. Mikolash in phase one is so easy, but it's also like when when he starts like strafing sideways and like backpedaling Kind of easy to get like greedy and mess up So 
So yeah, if you just like run up to him and then shoot him right when he starts running. Oh, I think I actually messed this up. Well, so there's actually a backup here too. So if this does happen and it doesn't work, then you can walk. Okay, wait, I don't know what the fuck he's doing. If you just stand here, he should walk over there. And then you can just walk in a little bit and he'll start walking towards you like this. I need to be very conservative here. Can you equip multiple tier 3 ruins? I think you can, right? If you do it, if you go back and get another one. Actually, no, you, you, wait, shit. I don't know why I'm drawing a blank whether or not you could do this. Each room needs to be a different rank. Yeah, I, I think you're right. For the miraculous room. Grant us eyes. Grant us eyes. I had a feeling that was going to happen. And he starts talking right when I try to pick up the jump. It's all because I bonked the wall. This weapon is too long, and it hit the wall. <laughs> I could have rolled away. I just wasn't expecting it to hit the wall. I mean, if I had a little bit... If I had a little bit more health, I'd be fine. But... I don't. <laughs> Getting one shot by the tentacle is kind of rough. At least when... Like, if I was using the sock cleaver, it's like... You can't even hit the wall with the sock cleaver. It's not even possible. <laughs> Fucking shred him. Slow, like, slow weapons are kind of scary against Miko. Because if he tentacles you... Like, some, some weapons are actually so slow that you can't even, like, combo him. Like he, like, he has enough time to do the tentacle. 
during during your combo. I'm just gonna use the one-handed form, actually. Please do something. Oh my god. Doesn't seem like I can hit the wall with this weapon. form. Oh! Majestic! Hey, Dark. I have died twice to Mikolash. Sad times. Miko and NG plus is scary. <laughs> Two-handed <po> <laughs> Two scythe is just not, not a good idea against Miko. Here we go again. That hit. This is actually kind of fucked up. Not gonna lie. New World is killing 3090s. Yikes. <sighs> Mikolash actually kind of triggers me sometimes. This guy's so fucking stupid. Hey, Audin. I should just poison him and go make the fucking heat up my food. I'm actually so annoyed that I'm fu I've fucking died three times this guy. <laughs> like. It's so easy for this dude to troll the shit out of you. I actually think I'm I'm just gonna fight him in the room. I think it's a better idea just to let him run to the room, cause between the puppets and stuff, I'm probably gonna fucking die again at this rate.
He like disjointed the tentacle. <laughs> the fuck is happening? Oh my god. I will poison him. I'm still gonna fight him, but I might as well poison him too. Let's fuck this guy. Is he poisoned now? Oh yeah, he just keeps teleporting. Shit, what's gonna happen if I drop down? Oh fuck. Oh. I'm just gonna bully the shit out of him. With my charged R2. I'm not taking any chances. Oh god. Okay, stay close. We did it, wow. Hardest boss down. <laughs> yeah, I should get some better gems. Hey, Chup, thanks for the bits, dude. Alright, well, well, now we can go get the Blood Rock, at least. Rockets? No, blood rock. The rock of blood. And these guys drop 50k a pop. That's. That's quite a lot. character buffered a fucking R2 when I got hit. Or like, I don't know. I, I, it like, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Let's check what gym I got. It's so annoying strafing around these brain ladies just because these rocks sometimes like get in the way. Oh wow, we got a 1% increase, dude. Let's go. Got the same one, dude. Hands. <laughs> I 
<laughs> yeah, 1% more. Got a 19.8 <laughs> on my previous, previous run. Never seen me kill those guys before. Uh, yeah, sometimes I just do it for the see if I can get a gem drop just for fun. Oh my god, imagine if I just got another stam one. Oh no, HP down. <laughs> Here, you bitch. down. <laughs> the blood vial tax, yeah. Is there a date for the Bloodborne view run? No. Maybe, uh... Probably like this Sunday or next Sunday, if I had to ch guess. Most likely next Sunday. There's no 60 FPS version of this game. <laughs> you have the choir bell. Yeah, I got a lot of blood on me. My arm is just covered in blood. We'll get all these gems. After NG plus two, I'll have three blood tinge gems and three arcane gems, which is kind of nice. So I could do an arcane or blood tinge run if I felt like it, I guess. Um, no reason to go get the living string. I'm getting some health. Fair. Okay, well, I got a lot of supplies. We can upgrade the burial blade to plus 10 finally.
All right. Looking good. Let's go do wet nurse. <laughs> All right, you know what? I'm actually gonna go. I I'm gonna go heat up that food though, cause I'm. I need something to eat. I'm really hungry. I'll be back in a minute, guys. I am back. <clears throat> Alright, I need to give my food a minute to cool down. Go kill wet nurse. Oh, 
over here, piggy. Oh god. Oh yeah, it's so weird. Wet Nurse gives like no souls on NG Plus for some reason. Well, go kill Cleric Beast, I guess. <clears throat> I mean, she gives souls, but it's just not that many. Like, Mikolash gave 400,000 and then Wet Nurse gave like 100. Sword roll. You hate this, Skip. Yeah, the wolf can be kind of troll sometimes. I won't kill the wolf. I need his help. stuck in a tree. <laughs> yeah, there's like a gravestone that he likes to get stuck on. He can get stuck in a few places. It's pretty annoying. Am 
Can I kill her with an oil urn, do you think? Can I kill her with a blood cocktail? I know you can kill her with a numbing mist. I wonder how many souls Cleric Beast gives. Now, I wonder what NG Plus is gonna be like in Elder Ring. They're gonna change, like... Yeah, hopefully the soundtrack is good. Good hunter would get very well. I feel like Sekiro's soundtrack wasn't super memorable, but farewell. What's up, Ozzy man? Why can't you perform the visceral attack when you stagger the enemy? Uh, you might be attacking too fast. Or too slow. You need to be like right on top of them as well.
Ah, uh, they're just chilling. I'm just eating my food real quick. Did I get the lamp? Yeah. This rice is delicious. I'm almost done, guys. Okay. I finished it at all. Feels bad, man. No more rice. <clears throat> I had some curry fried rice with chicken. Delicious.
thought this got the bounty. Got the bat. Well, I mean, I might still get it, but the bounty is kind of a load of bullshit. Like, I got the sub 140, but the bounty wasn't for the first sub 140. It was rather like. I don't know. The, the way it's set up is pretty dumb, but. <clears throat> like, once somebody gets the sub 140, then it's like. There's like a two and a half week waiting period before I get the bounty, and if somebody else beats me, then they get it. And like, I don't know, if somebody beats me, maybe the deadline gets extended. So maybe the deadline. Like, I, I don't. I don't know. I know that there's like one dude who's been There's one dude who's been running the category, so <laughs> Probably gonna be me. There's also a new 20 second time save And uh This is not going well. <clears throat> I mean, it's not a scam, I just- I didn't realize that's how it worked. Good thing I got that bold hunter's mark. Really? A fucking bold that's that's what they give you instead of bold hunter's mark. RE8's a fun run. But yeah, there's like a new 20 I think it saves like 23 seconds. There's a new strat in the intro for RE8. <clears throat> So yeah, my time is probably going to get beaten, but whatever, this is what it is. I don't really want to go back to RE8. I don't know, I think it's for the best just to be done with it. I mean, like, I, I could probably go back and, like, improve the run. I mean, I've ran the game so much, I, I'm, like, I definitely know, I remember how to do everything, but... Yeah, I just wasn't really having too much fun with RE8 anymore. angry when I ran R8. Yeah, I mean, I've been running it for like two months straight. Getting it. Like, the game is just so repetitive, too. I wasn't doing anything else. <clears throat> That's one of the great things about Elden Ring. Like, obviously I'm gonna be speedrunning it, but there's gonna be so much potential for challenge runs, and I'm sure there's gonna be mods for the game. All sorts of, you know, challenge runs, meme runs, all that. All that kind of stuff. And PvP, yeah. Uh... Mm. 
No, I don't think so. I can. I don't think I've heard of that. But speaking of Hollow Knight, or well, a game that's related to Hollow Knight, I guess. I need to play more Ember Lilies. Very well. Uh, let's go. I don't think. I mainly just have DLC now. Uh, but we could go kill witches and uh, Lugarius. <laughs> yeah, Silk Song. I don't know. I, I think. I honestly think that Team Cherry is just like very. I mean, they set the bar very, very high with Hol like Hollow Knight, and I think they really don't want to like let people down. So they're just working their asses off to make sure it's, you know, good or if not better than the first. <laughs> shards. I can get some in the DLC anyways. Mm. It's really good. Oh, it's the devs that made Titan Souls. I could definitely try that. Sounds pretty good. I shouldn't have killed her. She's probably gonna respawn how fucking tanky these guys are. Dude, I didn't even see her spawn.
Are you fucking serious right now? What in the fucking world was that? Wow. That was insane. That that enemy just hit me with like a 14 hit combo. Like I, I don't even know what was happening. It just felt like I I was like <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck, man? I think I'm actually gonna leave both the witches alive, though. Because if I if I kill the first one, it's gonna get kind of bad. The if you, if you don't kill one of them, then they never they never do the grab attack. That's that's super free. or what you mean? Okay, you might want a little bit more health than that, to be honest. Not gonna lie. Does it scale up? I don't think so. I think it only scales down.
I don't think Kanehurst feels unfinished. But I do wish it was a little bit bigger. been cool if Kanehurst was like a full you know like that so Elden Ring is basically going to be what you're asking for though like you'll probably there will be like Kanehurst but it's gonna be way fucking bigger probably gonna have like multiple bosses as well it's gonna be it's gonna be so good I really wonder if the areas are gonna like lead into each other somehow, like connect in certain ways, maybe. Cause it, it from what it sounds like in Elden Ring, you know, there's gonna be kind of like an open world area, and that's how you get to these like dungeons or whatever domains. Yeah, I know it's seamless, but I'm just wondering, like, geographically, are you just going to be able to... Like, are you always going to have to go back to the overworld, or are the areas, like, are these, like, dungeons going to connect to each other and stuff? I don't know. It'll be, it'll be really, really cool to see. I just can't wait to see what From Software comes up with. Is there anything special about this run? I mean, not really. It's just... We're just chilling, playing some Bloodborne. I'm getting a character ready for a viewer run in the future. I'll let you guys know for sure, like, when I'm gonna do it soon. It, my plan is either... I'm either gonna do the viewer run this Sunday or next Sunday. This is my plan. See you later, Chub. You know, I kind of want to get... I kind of want to get some rapid poison gems. Just for fun. For NG plus, so I can get the whirly gig saw and just go fucking ham. Whirly gig saw with rapid poison is like the most fucked up thing ever on certain bosses. <laughs> Probably have to farm for them though. Yeah, I know the poison rolling. Destroys Ludwig, Wet Nurse, I think Amelia. There's a few bosses it's really good on. What do Rapid Poison gems do? Rapid Poison is like... It's like bleed. More or less. What runes am I using? I'm using Moon Ruin, two Moon Ruins, and a Bam Ruin.
rapid poison is bleed. What is slow poison? Slow poison is poison. <laughs> it's... Weird that it's not called bleed in this of all games. Yeah, you know, it's kind of weird that it's called rapid poison. You, yeah, I think it call, you, they call it, like, I'm just like a bleeding gem or something. I don't know why I grabbed the knight's armor. I really need to do that. I wasn't really thinking. Although now I can wear it, I guess, if I want. I really need to get rid of this insight because my beast hood is so low right now. I do like the knight armor. Doesn't have very good beast hood stats, but as long as your insight's low, it's fine. I need to get the Bratter's helmet. It's so good. Oh my god, I'm out of pellets too. Yikes. Whatever. It's fine. Could have reposted. Visceral's do quite a lot of damage since I'm so high level. I guess I can just parry him. Well Moving around, but I'm moving around.
Every time, every time I tried transforming my weapon, I just wanted to shoot him. Every time I tried transforming my weapon, I kept getting hit by the fucking sword. God. I thought I was gonna fucking die, dude. That was like, not, that was not okay. Jesus. Go do the DLC. Or I could go back to the ch I could go do the defiled defiled chalices. Wait, where am I going? Not the right way to the DLC. <laughs> Just to use them if I want. I could also just I think I think I have them all unlocked in the store now, so I could probably just buy them as well. <clears throat> no, I'm I'm just setting up a character for the viewer run. It's gonna take me a few days though. So I still have to do four more runs after this, I think. But it's fine. Gives me a reason to play Bloodborne again. I could use the save editor to just, like, give myself a character at max new game, but I figure it'd be more fun just to do it myself. NG plus 7, uh, or rather, Bloodborne only goes up to NG plus 6 for difficulty. So it's just four more runs. I don't know why I grabbed that. The boom hammer. Yeah, I mean, the most substantial. The most substantial increase for New Game Plus is, like, the first iteration of it, obviously. We have almost enough supplies to upgrade two weapons fully. I need to remember to grab the blood, the blood rock in the DLC though.
Isn't plus six the seventh NG cycle? Mm, no. I don't think so. Like in Dark Souls 3 it is, but in Dark in Bloodborne it, it's the difficulty only goes. Yeah, you can buy rocks from the fountain. I guess I could buy one there too. But I do need some insight for pellets and papers and whatnot. But I don't need, I mean I don't need that many. That doesn't do too much damage. That's not bad. Mm, let's get the scythe. <laughs> yeah, Bloodborne's kind of rough to start off. I had one of my friends... One of my friends, like, visited... Uh, like, a year or two ago. And... You know, we were just, like, chilling. I think I was... I don't know what I, don't know what I was doing at the time. But anyways, he started playing Bloodborne. It was, it was super entertaining to watch, <laughs> to watch him learn it. But man, he struggled. He, he did manage to kill Gascoigne, though. Funny though, it, honestly... If you're dying to Gascoigne, you're actually better off just, like, restarting your- like, just making a new character. And running back, so you don't have to farm vials. <clears throat> After Gascoigne, it's not really worth it, but... Like, there's so many blood vial pickups at the start of the game. You don't need vials to beat him. Well, that's true. But most people aren't that patient. Yeah, I need to go spend my insight anyways. Even in a no-hit run, you need some vials for fall damage. <laughs> Sekiro's been the least beginner-friendly game they made. Yeah, I saw... <laughs> I saw one streamer stuck on Ogre for like... 
three uh, three hours. <laughs> For like multiple streams. I can't even remember. It was bad. Welcome home, Russian one. <laughs> hey, alienated panda, thanks for the prime sub, dude. Flat, thanks for the 35 months. Also, Taffles, thank you for the six. It's really good. Like, you, you recover like 10% health per hit. Pretty. And it, I can't even imagine if you had like a rally ruin on. Ah, uh, you were at my side all along. Framing that explosion is like the hardest thing ever to He's not a zombie, <laughs> but whatever it is, Cor the corpse thing. BL4, no paper, no pellet playthrough. Yeah, that sounds... Well, that, that wouldn't be too bad, apart from the DLCs. But even then, your damage could still be relatively decent. The pellet does help a ton. Oh 
Oh my. Way too close, dude. Dead. Good hunter, Jester. I never. I'm to sleep. Drowned by eye for a steady strike. So, um, Xander Monkey, thanks for the five months. Lise found your stolen bike today and returned it to you? Oh shit, well that's, that's good news. And, uh, Veteran, thank you for the 14 months. Speaking of stolen things, my dad actually got his car stolen. But, uh, we got it back. Stack. 
that beast meter? Oh, that. It's beautiful. Leaving well, you leaving one of these alive. It's not really leaving it alive. It kind of just stays alive because it glitches I out. Failed. But yeah, I've had that happen like once or twice. It's pretty funny. It's quite rare though. I think it happens because like one of them spawns right before. Oh my god, bro. I think one of them spawns like right as you kill the boss. Shouldn't need much more than 50 bit. That's like pretty dang good. <laughs> now we can just go for endurance and other stats. Right, let's just get some more pellets. A corpse should be left well alone. Secrets beckon so sweetly. <laughs> Only an honest death will kill you now. Liberate you from your wild curiosity. Stop doing that fucking attack.
weapon. Uh, I already did that earlier in New Game. I think I have the Rakuyo. I don't, I don't think I want to fight the sharks in NG Plus right now. I don't want to try to get some better gems though. Poison gems? I actually have no idea. Kinda curious. Well, I'm planning on taking this character all the way to NG plus six. I mean getting better gems isn't really worth it time-wise, but it will make the fights oh god. Make it uh sucks. I don't know if I can get Bratter's helmet any- I don't know if I can get his helmet anymore. on charge attacks? Holy shit. It's actually insane. But it's- the HP is obviously terrible. Yeah, you can iframe frenzy damage with the backstab. Or a repost. I mean, same- same thing. Or actually, wait, no, I, I got the key. Maybe, maybe, I, maybe I can still get the helmet? I don't know. Gamino. Very well. Farewell, good hunter. This isn't where I want to go. left to kill. <laughs> uh, just the final bosses and then Orphan, Lawrence. I also still have some chalices and stuff that I want to do though. I did the first three chalices, but I still need to do the defiled one and the the great one. I kind of want to get some gems for the like the later NG plus runs, but I could also, I don't know, it could take like a few hours to farm gems, which is... I don't know if I should bother.
changes. Such is the nature of man. <laughs> I could do the Lorange houses. <clears throat> I don't think I ever did it lower Loran before. Right, nice. This helmet's really good because it has well, it has like insane beast hood. Gives 50. It's <laughs> just like I think the best like the best other helmet that gives beast hood is like 20 or something, I don't know. It gives an insane amount. Alright, um I don't have to keep this. Yeah, you have to farm the Merciful Watchers. Problem is getting the getting the gems with like the stam, stam reduction is the hard part. I mean, I guess, like, what what else is a good, like, secondary curse? I, I mean, I guess durability isn't too bad, but you don't want all durability gems. If you just use one, it's it's okay though. I'd say. Covers my face, yeah, true. Skin down is fine. Oh, oh yeah, right. The durability gems don't stack. It's this, yeah. Forgot about that. I upload this stream on YouTube. I mean, to put it on YouTube, yeah. Alright, I forgot that it doesn't stack. I need like two of these. Don't need much for the chalices, but definitely save some insight. Second coming. What's up, dude? My GDQ run thing. That was a while ago. Did I get the 2k from the speedrun on RE8? Not yet. I don't know if I'm gonna get it at all. Well, like, the website is legit, but if somebody beats my time before July 28th, then they get the money instead. So if you have three gems that have durability down, does it just use, like... Like, let's say the durability down is different, does it just use the one that's the worst? The best? Probably the worst, I assume, right? <laughs> So Dragon Tears, thank you for the host, buddy. Well, people were saying it doesn't stack. My sub-140 isn't on the leaderboard yet? Yeah, because... The RE8 leaderboards take, like... 
a billion years to accept runes. It's because the, like, the queue on speedrun.com, they... So, for, to give you an example, I submitted, like, three runs on speedrun.com. They were all, like, PBs, right? Like, I got a... I, let's say, like, I got a 145, and then a 144, and then a 143. They don't have anything on the website that can just tell them, like... Like, they, they watched all three of my runs and verified them in the order that I submitted them. So they... They basically just, like, verified three of my PBs in a row when they really only needed to verify one of them. You know, the fastest one, obviously. So, I don't, I don't really, I don't mod for any super active speed games, so I don't know if it's possible for them to check stuff like that. But, you'd think, like, every time they check, like, when they're verifying a run, they should just make sure that there's no faster run from the same person, like, in the queue. No, I'm not saying they're dumb. I'm just saying that, that, like, the website might not... <sighs> the, the website might not have, like, a feature that allows them to view that. I don't really know. is not very good right now. Okay, this is just... This is... I'm just... Failing completely. <laughs>
can backstab him, like, right, like, as the electricity ends, but it's... If he's too close to the placenta, then you'll just get, like, insta-killed. But if he's far away, then you can manage it most of the time. But it's kind of scary. Because if the lightning hits you, then he's probably going to hit you, and then you're just, like... Pretty much guaranteed dead. No, people have been telling me about Death Store though. I kind of want to check it out. A lot of people are saying it's pretty cool. And slay the nightmare. Yeah, we'll, we're sparing the nightmare. Gamma. Very well. Alright, 30 endurance. I don't know if there's a soft cap for endurance. Can't remember. We got a nice, nice amount now. And do Dead Space Run start? I don't know. I don't know. Probably after Bloodborne. Might also play something else, though. We'll see. Uh, Alright, we need to go to the research hall and get Lawrence's item. I might go do the chalices for a little bit, though. It's with chat controlling the game? Um, no. Well, I mean, no. Not, at least, <laughs> I don't know if your phrasing is just, it's just, uh, a little weird, but, you know, it's like summoning people to fight the bosses. No, I didn't get the blood rock yet. <laughs> Actually, I'll go get that right now. Yeah, no, it's not like... Gosh. I would... <laughs> if there was gonna be a Twitch Plays Bloodborne, you would not want to do it on NG plus six. <laughs> So funny enough, there was somebody who made like a Twitch Plays Dark Souls. It was really popular. It actually had like a few thousand viewers up at one point, I think. Um, yeah, he made like a Twitch Plays Dark Souls. And they actually beat the game, but... Oh god. Oh Jesus. That was so close. Um, anyways, yeah, they actually beat the game, but the dude who made it, so like initially it was kind of like the Twitch Plays Pokemon style, where, um, you know, it's just like ultimate chaos, but then, then he added like a democracy system or something, he basically made it so like the game would pause, or like the game would freeze, and then you would... You would like do the you you would give the the bot the inputs or something. I I can't remember. Maybe there's somebody somebody here who who watched that a bit more. I think this is where the blood rock is. How was that? Isn't 
me an order. If Rose and Chad could vote on the next move, okay. Forty two bolt attack, four point one percent. Well that's any good. Might be good for the Tenitris, I actually don't know. Percentage is probably better though. I really w I wonder how much damage the Tenitris does with like full bolt gems. I don't know what the highest bolt gem you can get is, but Is there no sound? Okay, hold on. I think I know why. <laughs> the problem is when I'm tabbed off the... Like, I'm, I switch my source. switch my source on my monitor and then it gets like fucked up after a while just like thinks I'm not using the computer so it just turns off my my desktop audio yeah I'm also using display port We should just go into the chalices. Here, let me open up the false depth chalices. This is it. I don't know if there's any... I don't, I don't know what one I should go to, though. There's a Google Doc, is there? You can link it if you want. What am I trying to do? Uh, well, I was just gonna do some... Sorry, Nightbot. Nightbot gotcha. Yeah, this is...
Could we go to the cum dungeon chat? I've never been to it. <laughs> yeah, it's only echoes. <laughs> Why not 60 FPS? Because I want to play online on this character. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what is there. What is the best chalice for farming phys physical gems? I don't even know. Oh no, it... Wait. Why can't I go to the cum dungeon? Oh, there we go. Did my Is my audio gone again? Did it do it? Dude, what the fuck is... Why is it doing that? Well, let's see. Hold on. I might be... I might be able to fix it. Is it fixed? The cum dungeon? Stop? Whoa. Here? Is it this guy that dies? Let's see. Well, I don't need I don't need to do this. I just wanted to see. <laughs> you get quite a lot though. Your last message has the dungeon for 27 gems. Okay. Is there not is there a false depth that I could do without having to do FRC? I guess I might not be able to get the best gems, but they don't need to be, like, perfect, I guess. Okay. Did I even get the souls from that? No. <laughs> Uh, 
Well, it's not too bad to get the supplies for FRC, is it? I don't know, I can't remember. this guide. Some of these spread- sorry, I'm just looking at the spreadsheet right now. Alright, let's let's stop farming. I'm just trying to figure out what I want to do right now. Like what dungeon I should do. Hundred seventy four stamina. Insane. Yeah, we got a lot of stamina now. Yeah, we need Arcane Haze. Yeah, I have the blood sheets open right now. It's just, uh, it's a lot, it's a lot to read. Yeah, for FRC you need what? Three Sage's hair, five organs, three Bastard of Loran. That's quite a lot of insight if I want to make if I want to just buy them. Yeah, and you you also need ritual blood. By ritual blood. Alright, let's do the defiled chalices, I guess. Fuck it.
I think you can do Yarnum Queen. Is is Yarnum Queen's in a fall step the chalice as well, as well, right? I think. She gets her weapon buffed. Let's get her with the long range. L2 is actually pretty insane. Pretty easy. <laughs> okay. I mean, I kind of cheesed it, but why no 60 FPS? All right, open the door.
PS5 still runs on 30 FPS. I have a modded PS4 which runs on 60, but it can't play online. And the whole point of what I'm doing right now is so I can play online. <laughs> online on Bloodborne on PS5 or PS4, it's, it's not like different servers. The range is so good. <laughs> Love it. 20% fire attack up. Can barely punish the flame breath with the extended cleaver, yeah. Yeah, this <laughs> this weapon's range with the L2 is so good. Well, mainly just because it hits so high up in the air, too. Hey, Kitch.
the fuck is going on? That was pretty good. I <laughs> got all the defiled bosses first try. Not too shabby. There's one thing here. Okay, there's a false depth I can go to to get some Bastard of Loran, so let's just go there real quick. I have no idea how to get through this place. Figure it out though. It's a cool looking dungeon.
I'm lost. Two blood mounts. Where the hell? This chalice is omega confusing. I feel like there's gotta be an illustry wall or something. Unless there's like no lever. I don't see anywhere else to go. There's a door down here. Oh, wait. They drop gems. A triangle gem? Whoa. All right, see later, Barnacle. Is this gonna be ROM? Please no. <laughs> it's a brain sucker.
There are like no directions at all. On this Google spreadsheet. Supposed to be in a coffin. Where is the coffin though? Who fucking knows? Maybe down here? Oh, I see a coffin. just buy these with insight anyways. <laughs> but I don't have that much insight right now. You can just buy ritual blood. Witches are scary. Is this it? Forty five arcane attack. Okay, here's the bastards. There's two in there, so you can get three. Save me 21 insight. Not too bad. Have ritual blood for yet. I can't buy. I need to kill the queen. Yeah. So I can unlock everything. Oh fuck, I have to go get the red jelly. Oh yeah, I haven't killed Amygdala yet. Not I think about it. Completely forgot about Amygdala. Alright, come on. First try Electro Hole Skip. Let's go! Oh. <laughs> Coming like 20th try electro all skip. <laughs> the 
chalices are honestly more fun if you use a guide. <laughs> Chalices can be pretty, like, pretty annoying, pretty confusing. You liked explore, exploring the chalices completely? Yeah, I mean, you know, each their own. If you're in the mood for it, it's fine. Oh my god, my game crashed. God dang it. Uh, it's it's so funny because like the PS5 is more, I mean it's more than capable of running the game at 60 FPS, but the game just needs to be optimized for it. No, I mean there's still frame pacing issues even on PS5. It's like it's an issue with the game. It's not even like. Not even like a hardware issue. endurance. Ow. Not bad. Alright, we need... We need five inflicted organs. And three sages hair. Alright. Now we got the jelly, we need some more arcane haze. Deal. Now we can make final shells. Let's 
future update might happen in this game, yeah. Yeah, I wish. Miguel, thanks for the 57 months. How many chicken nuggets could I eat? And I don't know. It's a... I think the most I've ever eaten is probably like 20. Maybe like 30. Fifty for a bet. Yeah, that does not sound very nice. What's your favorite? What's your favorite nugget, chat, from fast food place? I think I like the Wendy's. The Wendy's ones are pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Swedish Max is nice. Oh, the, the fast food place called Max? That's what it's called, right? I think we went I think we went there a few times when I was at ESA. Yeah, the spicy Wendy nuggets are pretty pretty dang good. I'm a fan. Oh god, not this asshole. This guy's just... Where's my fucking gun? Staff, I don't know if we'll be able to though. didn't hit. That is bullshit. I should have done a running attack, I guess. That's bullshit, dude. Whatever.
I think Whirligig Saw is the only weapon that can compete DPS-wise, but even only only on certain only on certain bosses that are like stationary. Like for Amelia, I think the the Whirligig Saw is actually better. Same with like One Reborn. I don't even know what else. Arl, maybe, I guess. I hate the rifle spear so much. It's such a bad weapon. Yeah, an old patch with the glitch, it's it's a good weapon, but that's about it. Weapon is like break or something. Absolute camera fuckery. I should have rolled though. If I was going really well and then I just went for one attack, I shouldn't have. I had a feeling with that positioning, you might get me.
jumping away. The centipede's there because it's the it's the headless one. This is the Great Thumeru Chalice. I might run DS2 again, we'll see. Probably depends if they allow, like, the FPS switching for the runs, but I might run it anyways, even if it's not allowed. Yeah, Yarnum Queen BL4 was pretty... pretty molding. Baby only stuns you if you're Whoa Holy shit she did the fucking she almost got me. Settle down ladies
Finished her with the fist. Let's go. The Yarnum Stone. No timer, no. Nope. Alright. We're gonna buy nine. Gee. We need ten. We need ten ritual blood and. Six to mold. Well, I'm trying to think. Gamino. Do, I, do you get stamina after 40? Oh, no, you don't. Okay. You do get some health, but it's barely anything. I don't know if I... Does item discovery help with, like, getting good gems? I don't think it makes a difference from what I remember. Could be wrong. Hey, Comakine, thanks for the eight months, dude. Because they're guaranteed to drop a gem anyways, so I don't I don't think it makes a difference. Having like high item discovery. Or should I try to get some 27% gems? They aren't bad to farm from the edited watch. Watchers. Which Whenever I look up, like, stuff about gems in this game, it's just so... It's so overwhelming. What am I trying to get? Well, I I was just going to get some physical gems. It doesn't need to be 27%, though. Oh, I'm looking through the wiki right now. I don't know, Gwendolicious, to be honest.
Yeah, just sell stuff, I guess. I was gonna say you could just discard stuff, but you might as well sell it. Oh, does it, okay, does anybody, yeah, I know, you can get 25% gems from the watcher, like, a watcher enemy. Let's see, I, I see one. Hold on, I'll, I'll figure this out. See, it looks like there's two ch there's two different chalices that drop There's a few bosses that I have left still. more pellets. Alright, apparently the Watcher mob in the circular room in the first bonus area drops gems. I don't know if this is the best one that I could do, but... Got one gem. Four, twenty-four percent. Yeah, this one seems fast. We could we could probably get a few. We could probably get good gems from this guy pretty quickly. Apparently, what, what what slots does this use though? It's radials and crescent. Um. Yeah, that has HP down. It's not good. I should probably pick up, uh... What was I gonna do? Guys... You know, maybe I should just parry him instead. <laughs> Oh yeah, I was thinking it might be a good idea to go get rid of some of my gems and put them in storage. Just so, if something drops, it doesn't take like 10 years to check what it is.
sorted by Blood Tim's gem. And I forgot to pick up the Blood Tim's gem last time. Nice one. Probably should have gotten rid of some more, but. Okay. Grinding for my cost parasite run, yeah. I mean, I could also just, like, cheat them in, but whatever. I don't think this will actually take too long. Cheating them in is kind of complicated as well, because you need, you need to, like, figure out how to find the gems you're currently using, and then you need to change them into something else. It's definitely still faster than doing it like this, though. Claw Mark Ruin. Ritual Blood. Like, I wonder if you have a higher chance to get a gem if you have higher item discovery, since this is just like killing a normal enemy. I mean, it might actually be the case. It's possible. Pack down. Do I have the eye rune equipped? I don't even think I have the eye rune, but I could go put it on. Iron is from Wilhelm, right? Or whatever his name is. And Bergenworth. I don't think I ever talked to him. Still just new game plus. I wonder if Call from Beyond one shots you have 50 bit. I wouldn't even be surprised.
Oh yeah, you have to kill him. What am I doing? I don't know why I was thinking I just got it from talking to him. I wasn't like I literally wasn't even paying attention to what he what I got. nice being able to run for like ages I just ran all the way from the lamp the fucking door It's like Go put on that room. Should have put on the claw mark too. I think if I have the claw mark on, I can just like one shot this dude. The parry. Oh, attack versus kin down. That's not bad. Well, he's dropping a lot of these gems. Honestly, this shouldn't... I don't think this will take very long. Maybe I'm just getting lucky, though. Got another one. <laughs> Load times are fast too. Come on, give me the stamina one, please. What's the point of farming blood gems? Uh, mainly just to increase my damage. <laughs> I mean, I'm planning on using this character for a while, so... 
figured I'd just spend like an, an hour and farm some gems. I guess it's been a bit longer than that. Not that I haven't been farming for that long. I mean, if we were, if we were lucky, we could already be done right now, pretty much. Although I think I might want to try to get a triangle gem too. I don't know. the The cursed ones are the best, like the drop the droplet ones. But I don't. I think those are like super rare. HP down again. Yeah, this is on PS5. Oh man. Forgot how much I love farming gems in this game. <laughs> I'm just gonna answer it. It's really not that bad. Come on, just give me the gems. Please. one nice there we go it's only 23 percent but still that's still like a five percent increase there we go now one it is quite satisfying when you get the gem that you want though i gotta say Yeah, the 27s are only dropped by bosses, and the problem is, if I want to use that, I think I have to save scum, and making save files on PS5 is like utter dog shit, or at least it used to be. I don't know if it's like better, any if it's better than it used to be, but... Everybody who plays games has that struggle. Got one, but...
down, buddy. <laughs> Upload download option is in the game. Game icon menu. I don't even know where that is. Past it? Oh no, this is like... It's a 20 se Is it only 20 seconds to run to the lever? It's not too bad, I guess. Just one more. I mean, I went out of my, my way for the FRC stuff, so I could, I could try to get a gem or two from the FRC chalice, I guess. It seems like it they changed it. I think. I mean I could probably plunge attack him, but then he's just gonna hit me in the face. Yeah, maybe it would knock him on the ground. Yeah, I don't know why you can't delete characters. There's a better fall step for these cursed radials. Oh, what is it? Fighting two of these guys at a time uh, seems kind of annoying. <laughs> but I can try. Thank <laughs> you. 
All right, apparently there's two guys next to the bonfire here. Is it in the bonus area? Another eye rune in there. I have it. It's probably in like a chest or something. Spiders do not drop like any souls. Jesus. Looks much faster. Well, I'm looking for the eye rune. Don't worry. Oh, I think it's there. Even oh my goodness. and before there's not even like enemies here that drop gems. Is it these guys?
they're not that tanky, but... Do so much fucking damage. These guys are so strong, like, their attacks are just, you can't even, like, fucking get behind them. Yeah, I don't know how to fucking parry these enemies, They're, I've literally never fought this enemy before. These enemies are actually so... Stam, though. I don't think. Well, one of them was a six, maybe. attack ever. Oh my god. Stop that. 
downloaded their moveset, guys. It's all good. Just one more stam gem. That's all I'm asking for. Yeah, durability is okay. I'm, I was gonna say I'm, I'm gonna die. I knew I, I knew the moment that I didn't connect that I was pretty much fucking dead. Yeah, they downloaded my move set. Why does it take so long to load after you die? Punishment for failure. Well, the loads are fast if you, like, you don't die, they're fast. Blood vials. One of these days, I'll get a stamina gem. Stam is definitely the rarest, yeah. Well, let me look through these gems. Maybe some of them aren't too bad anyways. Like, this one's decent. But it's at full HP. This one is charge attacks, which is also decent. Physical attack. There's also durability down, which I could use. This one's also okay. Cauliflower head? Yeah, I think it increases item discovery, but I don't have it.
I don't think my item discovery is very high. 's so yeah the delayed attacks are kind of rough There's plunging attacks. I want this so badly, but I just don't think it's gonna happen. Oh wait! Oh shit! Well, this one's pretty okay. I mean, it's not quite what I want, but like... This one's not bad. Film like one more time. Okay. Nice. Okay. Yeah, no, it's good. It's just. I mean, it's, it's honestly, that gem's pretty freaking good because it's almost like a 27% in a sense. Except only for, it's like 27% to charge attacks. So. Alright, 
right, well, still not great, but it's definitely an improvement. We could try to get a... The thing is, I don't think we're going to be able to get a droplet gen very easily. Get an uncanny burial blade. Yeah, the thing is, I'm I'm not even gonna use burial blade anyways. Uh, I'm not gonna use burial blade for my next run, but I could get, I could try to farm a triangle slot, like a one good triangle gem, and then I think we'll we can just move on. Uh, I know that there's one good triangle gem. Okay, here is where we want to go. Two, five, eight. Eat. GM. Apparently you can get triangle gems from this one. Let's go check it out. Where is this guy? Lost Kirk.
You farm this so much for the triangles from the Watcher. So what's the fastest way over there? From down below? It's over this way. Snow Glow, thank you for the year resub. I already picked up that item. Poison. Yo, Pog. That's good. Well, we've got one gem for our rapid poison build now. <laughs> I want to try to do rapid poison on, like, I want to do a Whirly Gig Saw run and. Try rapid poison for some stuff. But I would need to get radial rapid poison gems as well. Oh, we got a triangle one. good for me, buddy? <laughs> stranger, stranger, thank you. Hey, Ashrama, thanks for the seven months. can also buy like 20 blood vials just by killing this guy. Like 30. <laughs> this guy. Is that a false depth dungeon? Did they rapid poison? Chalice is done anyways. Thank you for the seven months, Ashrama. And MLG Quickscoper, yo, thanks for the three months. Are you guys just loving this gem farming? <laughs> I 
everything you could have ever hoped for. Repost the fucking enemy. Hello? <laughs> hey, Marty. Thank you for the two months, dude. We're still farming for a little bit. Oh my god, he's like... His collision is too... slippery, I like... I dodge again... Okay, this guy is like never dropping these fucking gems. I dodge against him and my character just like slides to the side. When is the view run? Probably this Sunday or next Sunday. I'm not really sure when ex when I'm gonna do it. Want to give people a decent amount of time to get ready, whatnot. Dude, what the fuck? I got the one. I got the one gem, and now I'm not getting anything at all. Hey, creamy. You can join on any new game cycle, I believe. Though if you join... If you join on like a new game character, you're probably gonna get shit on. Okay, this guy like does not drop gems. <laughs> what the fuck? Best place to farm blood vials and bullets, yeah. This is great. Does item discovery actually help with this? Like, I don't know if it does. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's only gem- yeah, it's just drop chance. 
So like if there's a, I, yeah, I th that sounds right. I think like if there's an enemy that doesn't drop something sometimes, then it increases the chance, but. Oh, we can get a uh, 16 more item discovery. What level am I? Like, 150 or something? I don't think insight increases item discovery, but I... also might be wrong about that? I don't know. No, I don't have a- I don't have a max level character. I've never even gone to max NG on this game before. Ooh, an arcane gem? Oh man. By the time I get to NG plus six, I'm probably going to be like... The living failures bug? Yeah, that's true. Yeah, the air rune glitch is... I mean, yeah, you can basically get like max level if you do that glitch with the du the double... Oops, where am I going? is awful. I don't know if there's a chalice that drops like just norm like I don't know if there's a boss or a chalice that I can go to for just physical triangle gems. But I feel like that might be a better idea. We'll keep killing this guy until I run out of bold hunter marks, I guess. No, I don't think there's any consistent way to get the living failures glitch. The, it's just so, like... It's it's honestly RNG, because some so, the living failures are so passive that, like... Sometimes they just won't attack fast enough. Probably better if you... Yeah, no, this guy, like, doesn't drop fucking shit. Oh, there we go, maybe. Oh, man. Attack down. At least we got that rapid ch poison gem. That's pretty pog.
It's the max level per gem. I don't know. I don't know what the highest level rarity is. Yeah, I'll just have attack down. 27% triangles. Yeah, but isn't that a isn't that like an FRC chalice? I could do FRC. Yeah, the best gems are all in the FRC chalices, that's true. Pretty much. What slots does the Whirligig Saw have? Triangle, yeah. Let's Yeah, it seems like the best rapid poison gems are kind of annoying as fuck to get.
they're the worst ones to farm. Yeah, I could believe that. Right, let me get rid of the first. So let's see the bet. But I can't remember if you. I can't just search the glyph. Like the 27%, you have to like make the chalice right and then you search the glyph after. Right? Oh, yeah, and you need the root chalice as well. Is there an is root chalice? I think there is, right? There's one for every chalice, yeah. Yeah, so... If I want to get radials, I have to make the FRC Dumeru. And then if I want to get triangles, I have to do the FRC is chalice. Alright, hold on. I'll be back in a sec. I gotta go to the bathroom. Yeah, I've heard people are having issues with 3090s and New World. It's like, I don't know, it's like breaking the card or something. Alright, well, what do I do now, chat? What do you think? Do I try to get some other gems? Do I just... Going to NG plus two. Doesn't cap FPS in menus, so they're getting full power draw, breaking some cards. 
Yikes. I can already go to FRC, but I could go. I could go get more bastards of Loran if I need to. But I think I already have that one. C six. What? What is? What is in that chalice? Oh, you can. Oh, you can buy the root chalices. Oh, okay. See, I see that in the in the Google Doc now. Okay, well I could go do that. That's cool. Hey, Hamter! Thank you so much for the four months, dude. What's up, Taco? How's it going, sir? Moss Dogman, thank you for the 12 months, dude. Chalices here.
Alright, now I'm gonna eradicate. So apparently there's a bath messenger here. I don't I don't know where though. It doesn't say. Is it in the bonus area? Does anybody actually know? Oh yeah. Which chalice is this? This is... This is a false depth chalice. I'm going here specifically so I can... I think I... Oh, here it is. So you can buy the root chalices here. few weapons I might consider. I don't think I want the... Like, radial and triangle is what I want, mainly. If there's any weapons that have that as an alternative. Step chalices are actually so freaking nice, dude. I love it. All right, so. Red jelly? You can't buy red jelly, I don't think. Maybe you can. I don't even have any. I don't. I think you can. Can you get red jelly from somewhere? I don't know. Oh, you can get it with insight? I thought you need... I thought you need to make that Percy Chalice to farm it, if you want.
Can I Toblerone? Yeah, see, I don't have the requirements. Just because I haven't made this. You need to make one FRC and one Sinister? And they should all be unlocked? I need some... I need some blood echoes. Okay, well let's... let's go, um... Let's go to the conduct. I need... I need blood echoes. One's kind of weird. Doesn't like let you interact with it right away. I'm sure some people have fully explored the cum dungeon. It's an NPC hunter getting hit by a trap. Let's see. Okay, that should be enough. There's ruins you can use to get like more blood echoes. Okay, so we need five. Or, okay, wait. So you guys said I need to make. You need to have one done one FRC, right? You need you need to just make it. You make a defiled root chalice with everything. Right? that one the depth of five I don't have a depth of five I think it's that one I already made the normal defiled chalice For 27% gems, you need the Thumeru Ehil root shot. 
See, this is, like, I don't know. Everybody's telling me something different, and it's confusing me so much. I... Maybe I should just back up my save. I'm so confused. says make FRC defiled shells. Oh wait, so do I search from that one now? When I want to do certain ones? Wait, no, I can't search from this. I just need to leave it. Sorry, everybody's just saying something different and it's scaring me, and I don't like it. <laughs> What's up, waifu? But now we know. I should probably get a ruin to give myself extra health for these defiled chalices. I'm gonna go get that health rune from Nightmare Frontier. I think there, there's an even better one you can get from the chalices that are there. Fuck! 
<clears throat> Max beast rune, no fall damage in 100 beast hood. Yeah, that's pretty sick. Maybe I should consider grabbing that. All right, I'm going to get the tier three. I'm going to get the tier three HP. It's actually in this area though. I think it's in layer one. Some of these like descriptions are pretty bad. Yeah, I don't know why that was so loud. I'm sorry. There's nothing else down here. It's a side area before the layer one boss, oh, okay. Oh yeah, it actually says that here. It's just the the formatting is kind of confusing and I don't know which I was, yeah, I was just a bit confused. Okay. Yeah, I've got a 119 in uh, Dead Space now, waifu. skips Well, there's like loads and loads of different chalices you can do. There's like crazy amounts. <laughs> and a lot of the best ruins are actually in the chalices. Pretty much all the best ruins are. Where do you get that hat? From the DLC. I'm killing Bratter. Yeah, seeing something like Chalices in Elden Ring would be cool, though I don't... I mean, if they spend... Like, the thing is that Chalices must have taken a lot of dev time in Bloodborne. Like, I know they're randomized and stuff, but they definitely still took a lot of dev time. So, like, you know, if they spend more time working on just the main game, that's fine, too. Yeah. 
hatches. These false depth chalices make the make them way more fun fun as well. Cause there's way less like required shit that you need to do. Like you can actually you could make like an SL1 character and get like the best gems if you really wanted. I mean it would be kinda cancer, but you could do it like pretty you you can get things going pretty quickly. Quite nice. Yeah, it's 15% max health. We don't need the stamina right now. I'd rather have the health. Um, right, I'm trying to think what else. Also get claw mark tier three, I guess. Might be a good idea. I can get that, and then I can just fucking. It'll make farming the gems a little easier because I could probably do way more visceral damage. Sav. Right, it says it's in a treasure coffin on layer one. So I assume that just means like inside the normal layout. Maybe it's over this way. Maybe. Found the lever. It's like a treasure on layer one, but I don't know. Where the hell is this thing? No treasure down here. Doesn't say it's in like the like the boss bonus area, but 
Uh, maybe they just... area I guess. Wait there Oh no there was a bonus area, okay. Level 155. Stop! <laughs> God, why does boning take so long in this game? Yeah, Sekiro is even... Why is there an item there again? That's so weird. It's like it... I guess it's because I'm an NG+, plus. it like... spawns another one or something. It's, it, it's not the claw mark rune, it's just like a... it's like a whatever you get if you already have the item. Strange. Alright. Madman's knowledge, yeah, I, I think you're right. Okay, so we could probably go kill those guys now if we wanted. Uh, now we have 50% increased visceral damage, so we could probably just go in and parry the parry the heck out of those dudes. Uh, right, let's see over here. The thing is, I don't I don't know if I should like. Should I just back up my save data if I'm gonna farm gems from these dudes? I feel like the lever kind of takes a while, but... I don't know if it takes longer than... Because you have to, like, delete the chalice and then add it back again, right? Think. I 
Or am I wrong about that? It's probably better just to back up my SIG data. Well, we can test the, the save data. What the fuck is this? So, I don't think I've ever seen a ladder leading to a boss before. Well, it seems pretty easy to download now, at least. It looks like they improved the save load function on PS5 quite a bit, but it was like really annoying before because every single time you wanted to do it, you had to like go into the the menu and choose the. I should be. I should just. Or I was gonna say I should just play off. Can I play offline once I've made the chalice? Or can you not even enter it? I don't even know. Here we go with these assholes. Actually, really, really helpful for these guys, I gotta say. Are you gonna take out your weapon? If I remember right, like if you if you have 99 arcane, you can basically just spam executioner gloves on these guys and they just they just get fucking shit on. The 26% attack versus beasts down. Uh, let's just, I don't know. That's actually decent, but we only need one anyways, so might as well just reload. Good gem for PvP, yeah. All right, let's test to see if I can enter the chalice offline. Actually, this is this is this chalice that I'm joining isn't I don't know. Let's see. I mean, I'm already in the chalice, so it's not going to like take me out, is it? easy to parry. Yeah, the visceral damage is quite satisfying. I'm actually 
actually surprised that connected. At least they drop a triangle gem like every time, don't they? Yeah. So, it probably won't take too long to get what I want. Attack versus beasts down again. <laughs> Sick. I think there was an option. What am I looking for? I'm just trying to get a good triangle gem. Just for my NG plus runs that I'm going to do in the future. It's definitely not necessary, but it's fun being OP and NG+. Plus. <laughs> increased stamina cost, yeah. I mean, either increased stamina cost or maybe, like, kin. Uh, kin down would be alright. There's not too many kin bosses in the game, so... Weapon durability is okay. Depends what weapon you're using, though. I don't think Orphan is kin. dude. Hey, shoot your gun or fucking... Let me hit you. He doesn't want to take out his weapon. <laughs> Come on, baby. Attack down. Sick. <laughs> Why is that even like a thing? <laughs> it's so fucking stupid. <laughs> it goes up, but it also goes down.
guys. Give me some good shit. Please. <laughs> Attack down! You bitch! It's the end goal. I mean, there isn't really any end goal, necessarily. <laughs> I don't know why I'm pressing apply to all. <laughs> I don't even need to do that. Yeah, it was the best one as well. Can't be much longer, right? I don't need the gem. I mean, nobody needs the gems. But they're good. And they increase your damage. And I'm planning on doing like four more runs anyways. So I was like, whatever. Why not? I'm done with Mario, at least for now. Oh, okay. That guy's gone. We'll just run back. Well, yeah, real pros just cheat in the gems. <laughs> but honestly, gem farming, like, if you want to go absolute tryhard and get, like, like, min-max, like, crazy, then you have to farm a lot. But you can get some pretty decent gems in just a few hours in the chalices. It's not too bad. Thrust gems are insane. What what is the highest thrust gem you can get? Fire gem. You know what, I'm gonna keep that. I don't even care. I'm gonna keep it and remake the chalice. Fuck it, dude. I mean, I don't know if I'm even gonna use this fire gem, but whatever, dude. If I do decide to, like, do a boom hammer run or something, maybe that would be good, I don't know. Is fire, like, what is fire even good for? I don't think I'm online right now. Am I? I don't know. No, but I mean like what... I mean like what weapon? Like what weapon would you even put fire gems in? Like into? I mean, I guess you can put him in any weapon, right? 
It just, it, it changes the damage to elemental instead. Yeah, the flamethrower doesn't even have slots. <laughs> this toilet bitch! Well, maybe I should have just reloaded, but whatever. This is some epic chalice farming right now. <laughs> I'm using five PWUJSCD. Ritual bloods now. Oh, I'm gonna have to make another save now, too. All for this fire gem that I'm not even gonna fucking use. Whatever. I gotta say one thing about the Souls games, I've always felt like infusions are kind of underpowered, or like, just really not that useful. I mean, in Dark Souls 2, you do infuse your weapon, but, like, for the most part, I feel like infusions are kind of just a meme. They have some use, I guess, but... Most of the time, it just makes the weapon worse. <laughs> I really hope in Elden Ring that's not the case. Well, yeah, I mean, sharp and heavy infusions. I guess I'm, I'm more so, I'm like thinking about elemental. There's so many infusions in DS3 that are just kinda... Kinda meh. please. I love how he tries, like, he hits you with those little 
lantern does like fucking nothing. Okay, come on, chat. This is the one, right? This is the one. Attack versus. B it's a 27%, but. It's versus beasts. I don't know, man. I'm not gonna use that. Son of a bitch. There's just too many beasts in Bloodborne. If it was versus kin, I might actually just roll with it, to be honest. Yeah, we need some dist blesses in chat, guys. Come on. I need your assistance, chat. I need your blessing. Oh, <laughs> majestic! Hey, Frontier, thank you for the 13 months, dude. be able to parry on staircases in Elden Ring. <laughs> oh. Come on, baby. Please. Ah! <laughs> HP deplete. Please. Okay, is there a, is there a five HP regen on your gun? That's yeah, that's not too bad then I guess. I'm getting it out of shape. Yeah, probably too. This guy constantly shooting his sword. <laughs> Wish I could kill these guys faster. Come on, baby. 
Oh my god, another fire one? I swear, if this is Stam again... Are you serious? What the fuck? Try ARP. Try them performing triangles. There's a brain sucker as the gate guard. I mean, it shouldn't be any different though, right? Like, I don't- I don't think that dungeon will be any different than doing this one. But, you know, correct me if I'm wrong. I mean, maybe certain dungeons have better drop rates. But, I mean, this- These guys all- unless the boss fight's, like, easier. These guys always drop the triangle, so... Well, I'm just loading save anyways, so it doesn't really matter at that point. Okay. This guy, like, does not want to use his weapon. <laughs> Another- uh, dude, I, I shouldn't even check. What are these fire- why am I getting fire gems? You get a mixed bag in the is chalice. Hmm. Well, I think you can only get the triangles from is anyways, right? What what's the highest that charge attack gems can go up to? I should try like a charge attack only run with the stake driver with like 37% gems or some shit. That'd be insane. 36. Yeah. Why is the Relax. <laughs> this guy's going. <laughs> this guy's going in. He needs to settle down. 
Adept? Adept is for... Wow, 32% thrust attack. Weapon durability down, though. That's pretty... That's pretty good, but... I mean, I could keep... I could keep this and remake the dungeon. Should I do that, you think? I don't know. I don't know. There's not too many weapons that are... Ugh. Yeah, I guess I can. Why not? Yeah, the scythe isn't thrust, but... I mean, I can keep... You know, I can just keep this character for, like, NG plus meme runs in the future if I want to. Maybe if I want to do, like, an NG plus six marathon run or something. What dungeon am I on? Uh... 5PWUJSCD. It's a save edited version of this, and it has 27%. I can try it. This is for triangles, right? Is this just like the same exact chalice? Just... save edited version or something? We gotta make another save. Also, uh, Velvet Candy, thank you for the year resub. Hero of Kavach, thank you for the two and a half years. Pontus, thank you for the gift sub. I think I might have mentioned that one. And, uh, Fracture, thank you for the 26 months. Man, it uploads faster than it downloads. <laughs> it's kind of surprising. Let's see if this, uh, this dungeon glyph is any better.
This, this is not. God. Why is it? Let me backstab. Please. All right, here we go. Let's go, dude. First try. Damn, Coltrane. Coming in with the, the perfect one. <laughs> I could go for the radials since I'm kind of... We're in, we're in grinding mode right now anyways. Maybe, maybe I'll just go for the radials too. You got another one? Okay. Oh yeah, I should have bought the uncanny burial. Well, I'll, I'm only gonna use it for a few more bosses anyways, so whatever. We can just socket the gems and NG plus two. Um, what's that glyph? It is ZBC6BQES. Uh, let me try that radial one then. I'll leave that one there. Forgetting, I need to go back online. They last forever. Uh, I think so. Like once they've been made. Yeah, I mean, there's there's like three different versions of every weapon. There's like a the there's the normal version and then there's an uncanny version and then there's a lost version. And the uncanny and lost versions have like different gem slots. Uh, okay, Z A K U And what if somebody could just I think I just got lucky, but what what if like you could actually just save edit the dungeon? So it just always drops the best in slot gems. <laughs> God, that would be that would be amazing. Hey Flitwell, thanks for the two months, dude. But no, it's it's not the move set, it's just the, it's just the gem slots. It's like different types of gem slots. Well, certain, like, you can only get certain types of gems in certain, like, forms, so... Like, some, if there's, you know, if you're trying to go for a certain build and, you know, there's a really good triangle gem, but the weapon doesn't have a triangle slot, then you could, like, you know, get a different version that has a triangle slot, potentially. Oh, people... <laughs> people keep saying that my game looks really good. I, <laughs> I don't... I don't know why. I mean, it's just... It's just on... Yes, yeah, I haven't done anything crazy.
arm for an out of shape gem. Yeah, out of shape is like droplet, right? Like it just goes into any slot. History. Thanks for the 57 months. Man, I'm getting hungry again. Yeah, thank you for the 57 months, Match History. Welcome back, buddy. <clears throat> Yeah, on a big TV, I don't think Bloodborne looks very good, just because it runs at like 1080p max. I kind of like this arena more, to be honest. Weapon at risk. Oh god. guy I should just attack spam I think <laughs> an adept one again oh HP depletes <laughs> like we could make a thrust build potentially if we wanted to but HP, I don't know. H HP depletion is just so annoying. If I get an Adept Gem that doesn't have HP depletion, I'll keep it, but... Yeah, I'm going for Radial Gems now, because... Well, I don't know. We're in, the gr we're in the grind mode anyways. Might as well. We'll get... We'll, we'll grind out these gems, and then we'll uh, finish off and go to NG plus two. Thrust improves visceral attack? Really? Well, I don't think it's... I don't know if it's necessary that Sony doesn't want to put it on PC, because the game is... Like, they've been porting a, quite a few games to PC, but... Sure, there's there's reasons. No, this game pretty much runs the same on six uh, on PS5 as it does on PS4 Pro.
parry that attack. Never really tried. I don't even... Oh, it's a kin one. Uh, my grinding gems. Yeah. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna keep this kin one and get and put some of these in storage. Fun? Yeah. It's... You know, it's actually kind of chill. I don't... I don't mind it that much. Feel sorry for me. Thanks. <clears throat> Am I still going to do dead space? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Looking pretty clean now. I made it over here. DKK UA app. This is what it was. Thank you for reminding me to repair my weapon. I will do that. I guess I already have a 23% stem gem, so this is a little overkill. <laughs> I mean, if I get one 27%, I could just I could just roll with that. I don't know. We'll we'll see how we'll see how my luck is. I guess. It's been a long time since I've farmed any gems. I think the last time that I did chalice farming was like two or three years ago. At least like, you know, to this extent. Oh yeah, I need to climb the ladder. I think it was when I was doing, um, I did it like a cost parasite run in NG+. Yeah, I've I've shown through uh I've shown the hacked chalices and stuff a few times on stream. With like the cut content or whatever. 
Hey, oatmeal boat. Thanks for the three month resub. Yeah, I don't know, Drunken Pelican. I mean, I think it's just like... You know, just another another design ended up being used, or... You know, they just scrap it for some reason. Doesn't fit the game. It's not working out the way they it planned. Who knows? Who knows? When's the viewer run? Probably this Sunday or next Sunday. Uh, I'll I'll let you guys know soon. There's no staircase here. God. I should just move into him and just parry him though, I think, instead of attacking. Alright, here we go. Another kin. <laughs> Dang it, dude. So, what bosses in Bloodborne are kin? I always ask this, but I can never remember exactly which ones... Which ones it is. I mean, I know Abriatus is one. Abriatus failures in Rom. I don't even know if Rom is. Wait, is he? I guess he probably is. I don't think Koss isn't Koss isn't even a, isn't Ken. Yeah, I think it's just em emissary Ram and Abriatus, and maybe failures. So people say Orphan Phase One is Ken. It wouldn't be hard to test. Visceral damage is just so much more than anything else.
Pack vs. Beasts. Yeah, I mean, I, I was just curious. There's definitely way more bosses that are beasts. I mean, what, what bosses are beasts? Like, Cleric Beast, Blood Starved Beast, Amelia, uh, Lawrence, Ludwig. Is Parl a beast? I guess he is. I mean, he has hair. <laughs> kind of. Yeah, he's at. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I guess he's called Dark Beast Parl. We got one! Let's go! That didn't take too long. kind of gem my farm for it's the one i just got it's like 27 percent damage three percent stem what We just need one more. I think... I also want to get rapid put... No, I haven't been farming for eight hours. I mean, I did all the... I did all the story chalices, and... Then I was farming some other stuff. I should have just went straight for the 27% gems. I was like messing around in some of the other false step chalices, but it's fine. I didn't really understand how it all worked right away, so. Like basically you just need to do, you just need to make the defiled root chalice with FRC and then you can just basically join anything. 
because you can buy you can buy all the sinister root chalices these things like Sinis sinister thumeru lower loran you can buy those all from like this one dungeon which makes it super easy it's really fucking nice honestly <laughs> chat was kind of giving me a bunch of like mixed information so I was kind of confused at first yeah the false depth chalices make chalice farming like a thousand times better really nice but yeah but the, the like I was saying the oh information wise yeah the chalices are like super overwhelming I mean, I play this game a lot, and it's still, like, whenever I, like, look at the chalice guides and stuff, it's just, it's just like, so much, so much information. It can definitely be a bit overwhelming. Alright, chat. I'm making a very risky bet here, but it'll, ma it'll make this next one intense. If, if I get, <laughs> if I get the, the best gem, or if I get the stam gem from this next kill two times in a row, I'll give the 100 subs. <laughs> but I'm gonna go to the bathroom first. So. We'll see. We'll see. I'll be right back. By best gem, I mean the, the stamina gem. <clears throat> Alright, here we go, Chad. Zero chance. There's actually a decent chance. It's probably like 10%. Maybe...
relax. Dun dun dun. Nope. Wait. Yes, I actually did get it. it well, okay. It's. <laughs> It's not the best, though. <laughs> it's not 27.2. But... It is just... It is just stamina one. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. <laughs> I actually don't know. Gotta keep farming. I mean, I could just roll with the 26%, to be honest. No, increased stamina cost is the best one because all the other ones is either like reduced damage against certain types of enemies or like weapon durability down or uh, like it's a, you, there's always a curse. The best gems always have a curse. I don't know, it's only 1%. I was planning on using Rapid Poison for the, um, I was going to use Rapid Poison for the Whirligig Saw. Was my plan. And the Chikage might be good though, because it already has Rapid Poison on it. All right, I'm gifting some sub anyways. <clears throat> I'll go for half. We're not going to I'm not going for the full 100, but <clears throat> All right. What? <sighs> Very well. <laughs> Lobos got gifted. So, how rare are the rapid poison gems? Are there, like, there's some. There's some bosses that. Yeah, if you want to link that to me, Coltrane, I'll check it out. They're the worst. <laughs> yeah, probably. Like, is it- is it pot? Some bosses are immune to rapid poison, I think. Moon pre Wait, so can you- you can actually use Rapid Poison on every single boss, except Moon Presence? Oh, really? Wow, that's cool. I- I was under the impression it only worked for certain bosses. Some have really high resistance. Yeah, but if you have really high Rapid Poison, it probably still can build up, I guess. Well, that's cool. Alright, well, I kind of want to try to make, like, a Rapid Poison build, but uh, I don't know. Getting the getting the best Rapid Poison gems is going to be kind of horrible, I think, right? We could try for a bit. Still takes a ton of hits. Rapid Poison builds are not worth it. Yeah, yeah, I know. I just, I want to try it anyways. Um... Yeah, can you post that in chat, Coltrane? Or did did you post it in chat? Here's the link. Oh, okay. Okay, I was also on the Bloodborne wiki.
Because we have a we have a triangle. So we already have one at least. We got this luckily <laughs> when we were farming triangle gems. Um so we have one. Which is nice. The whirly gig has two radials and a triangle, so I just I'd need to get two radial. online. You said the bottom half is save edited dungeons? Oh, the section lists save edited dungeons with modified gem effect pools for improved drop rates of non-fixed gem effects. Okay. Did I not go online? Oh my god, what am I doing? <laughs> I'm just like spamming. So I think I want uh, to go... Choice, stranger. Oh, let's see. There's an easier farm which you could use for the Logarius wheel. Is the Logarius wheel good for applying rapid poison though? I mean, it does do a lot of, like, I think there's some multi-head attacks that you can do. Man, chalice farming is kind of like, uh, it's kind of like gambling. <laughs> you just, like, pray. It's kind of exciting when you get a good drop. This is probably going to be horrible though. Trying to get trying to get these. Chalice is quite big. Oh my god, we found it. <laughs> well, that was easy. Uh, I'm most likely going to be doing the beer run either this Sunday or next Sunday. I'm gonna I'm gonna say most likely next Sunday. I don't want to give people a little bit more time to prepare and get characters ready and stuff if they want to. My blood level is probably going to be like 300 by the time I get to NG plus 6. Or like 250. I don't know. It's probably going to be pretty high, I imagine. And thank you for the gift sub to Coltrane at the Grimstar. Hey, Beyblade. Oh, 
god, not the staircase again. Health is really low. Oh, my God, just fucking shoot the gun. <laughs> Carrying that is kind of annoying. <laughs> First try. <laughs> the game really wants me to do a fire build. I'm gonna keep it. <laughs> Fuck it, I'm gonna keep it. God, a fire build is probably just... Well, it's probably good for some stuff, I guess, but... Could, could try, like, boom hammer <laughs> fire jumps, I guess. What's the record I'm most proud of? I don't know. Granny. No, I mean, I don't know. I don't, I, I, I'd never really have like ran a game like super, super seriously for an extended period of time. Like I, 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 I speed run a lot of different games. So I don't really feel like I've, there's ever been a run that's been you know, just like a crazy amount of effort. What's up? Sorry, I had to go for a second. I lost the boss record. I don't know, did I? You tell me. Yeah, Ray has the glitchless record. He's had that for a while now. So I switched over to any percent.
Okay. Uh, yeah, people are, well, they're doing, like, voting right now for the FPS toggling for Dark Souls 2. It's kind of like split 50-50. If I had to guess, the leaderboards, there's probably going to be, like, two, the leaderboards are probably going to get, like, split. I think. Hey, Counter Kitty. So, so I'm just going to say right now, sorry if anybody was uh, looking forward to uh, Dead Space. But I don't think I'm going to do any Dead Space today. We're just chilling with Bloodborne. I'll do Dead Space tomorrow. I feel like getting these poison gems is going to be absolutely horrible. Maybe I should go for the easier farm. Like what what do you what do you think the drop rate on this is? I feel like it's really low. I feel like I could this I feel like this could actually take like hours to get these gems. Has anybody here farmed for rapid poison before? <laughs> I did not see that, Kyle. Congratulations, though. Zeus did, and it took all day. Oh, God. The most degen. No, I runes don't even help. There's easier ones that you can farm from these like great like uh scorpions, I think, that they're not too much worse. I feel like I should just go for those. Because I could probably get those relatively quick. Uh, you can get rapid poison ones from, from the scorpions.
Yeah, I, I think I think these rapid poisons are just not not a good idea to go for. I think I could, I could, I'm down to farm the scorpions though and just get the shittier ones, I guess. There's like six different gems that drop here. Yeah, that's the, that's the problem. And I I could end up with a rapid poison gem that's like HP down or something terrible, like minus 15 health or some shit. I don't know if it can be that bad, but I feel like for NG plus six though, like rapid poison's probably pretty good just because the bosses have such like big health pools. And I'm pretty sure the rapid poison proc is like percentage based. So These guys like AFK so much at the start of the fight. Yeah, you need a you need a dirty one. I think poison is like the it's like the least likely drop. I like want to keep. <laughs> I really, I really want it, but it's this is just not this is not a good idea. Should I go try to farm the scorpions? You think? It's so. The scorpions can drop gems that give. 17 rapid poison and the these guys can drop 22 rapid poison so it's a difference of about five hmm. let's try one more and then we'll hmm. we'll go hmm. see Mm. Hey, oh. end district. Thanks for the three months. No, there's. Well, yeah, I guess it's up to twenty-two, or well, it's up to twenty-one point nine. Okay, sure. I mean, <laughs> that's pretty good. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I mean, it's only good against beasts, but man, it's it's good against beasts. <laughs> Thirty percent. That's 
That's a lot. <laughs> like, holy shit. Let's go check out those scorpions. And we've we've gotten a lot of weird gems today. Should just stay on mine cuz I keep <laughs> I keep needing to recreate the chalices anyways. Well, yeah, you can you can just remake the chalice if you want to farm it, or you can back up your save data. Wait, what? Why doesn't this one work? <laughs> you can't you can't use chalice clips offline. <laughs> Definitely doesn't work there. Alright, let me see. Um... You can also kill Bone Ash Hunters for a chance at a Rapid Poison Gem. I don't know if that's going to be any better, though. Oh, man. There was one that was listed in the save-edited dungeons, but it doesn't work. I wonder if the other one works. Why does this one work? Let me see. G Y W U U E Man, what? I wonder if they typed it wrong or maybe it I don't know. Weird. I think these hunters are pretty horrible to kill though. <laughs> like I don't I don't think this is gonna be very fun. These hunters are actually super easy to kill with um with high arcane. Maybe I can parry them. 
I know with high arcane you could just run in, use like a few executioner gloves, and they're just dead. This is like... This is just awful. Why does he have hyper armor when he jumps? even drop anything. Do these guys respawn? I don't actually know if they do. Okay, they do. I mean, if I could... If I could parry, I could, like, one-shot, I think. Oh, not quite. Oh my god, did we just- we just got one. Attack versus Ken down. Yo, there we go! We already got one. Boom. Oh, okay. I don't know if I should put the eye rune on. No, maybe using the scythe is better. Um, for this iron will help. Yeah, that's what I thought. All right, I need to go back anyways. Am I doing a specific build? I'm just trying to get uh, rapid poison gems. I just wanted to try a rapid poison build for NG+, because I've never done it before. <clears throat> yeah, this is just this is this is just character building for that NG plus seven run. Carrying this guy is so difficult. <laughs> At least he responds though. Yeah, if you if you have high arcane, you can just spam executioner's gloves on this dude and it, it only takes like I think you can do it in like three or four. They did they just get wrecked. Don't even know what to do. Hope I don't get. Like, how the. I guess if I stay close enough, they'll keep attacking.
I just have to bait the follow-up attack, I think. Oh wait, was that a fire gem that I got? The parry timing is not fun for this. How is that not? Carrying these hunters is not fun. Well, they drop gems pretty often. Maybe there's a way to, like, cheese this guy. One more chat. I need to stop streaming soon though. It's getting kinda late. Um, oh, hello, G Fuel Energy. Sponsors are here, guys. Oh, my goodness, this enemy. <laughs> Another beast hunter. <laughs> Add fire attack. <laughs> what are these gems, man? Follow me on Twitter. Oh, thank you. <laughs> no worries, man.
good. Estus flask blade. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking like a like an Estus Estus peach flavor would be pretty pretty insane. At least we got one so far. I'm getting better. Looking for a dirty gem. Oh, attack versus kin up. Interesting. spam seems to be pretty effective. Honestly. Hell, sometimes. It's a little random. Also, Big Jeff, thank you for the 20 months. And Wandrick, thanks for the gift sub to G Fuel Energy. Thanks, man. Yeah, I refilled my supplies at least. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Getting a lot of souls.
sometimes this enemy is like so easy to kill and then sometimes it's like the worst thing ever murky what the heck is a murky gem slow poison oh shit it's even a stamina one too dang We're gonna get it, guys. <laughs> or I'm, or I'm gonna die. Why not use the scythe? Just a bit slower, mainly. How to get the helm? You have to kill Bratter. You either have to kill his, his like, summon. Dirty? Woo, shit, we got it. They're both verse kin down, but we got him. We got him, baby. Chat. Well, let's. Yeah, there's barely any Ken in the game, anyways. Got a fully, <laughs> fully poisoned up whirly gig saw. Oh god, it does fire damage. <laughs> because this one fucking gem gives fire attack. <laughs> That's so bad. If my arcane was higher, it would actually probably be fine. Gam in a way. Very well. Not much extra damage. Farewell. Well, I mean, the weapon will still do physical damage, and I could use beast blood pellets if it did physical damage. Since it does fire, I literally won't do anything. Yeah, I need more strength. That's fine, though. I could go to the cum dungeon. <laughs> I need to. Um, all right, well, yeah, we don't have, we don't have any, we don't have a 27% for this one, but we do have a 27% triangle. So 
We are in pretty good shape, chat. Pretty good shape. Yeah, I, I want to do a run with the... I might do like a Holy Moonlight Sword for one run as well. I might try that out. Uh, yeah, armor is fire damage, boom hammer playthrough, yeah. But yeah, we'll probably do like Holy Moonlight Sword one run. We'll try a run with the the Rapid Poison Whirly Gig. All right, I can um, I can kill Garmin and Moon Presence. And go to NG plus two, I suppose. Yeah, I've done stake driver. I kind of want to go for charge attack gems, but charge attack gems are like super rare. It's like it's like the it's like the rapid poison ones I think it just there's a pain in the ass to get because they're like really low drop rate you can get them much easier what charge attack gems really okay well shit Maybe I will try, um, maybe I'll try like a, maybe I'll do stake driver charge attack only or something with the, the maxed out gems. That sounds kind of fun. <laughs> Yeah, if, th if that's not too bad, we could farm for those another day if, if you say they're easy to get. You can also get... You can also get a gem that has, like, 28% charge attack and, like, 12% attack up at full health. But I think those are a bit harder to get. Since it's, like, two effects. Pebble run? Yeah, that's never gonna happen. I don't think anybody's ever gonna do a pebble run. If I used all the boards. 27% waning gems? Probably. <laughs> My visceral is gonna do so much damage to me. <laughs> well, I guess it's energy plus. But... What was it? The hunt? The blood, or the horrible dream? I should probably try to get oh, a rapid poison gem matter. that doesn't have fire on it, though. I mean, it's not really a big deal. It always comes down but, to the hunter's helper to like, clean there's up some bosses that are fire resistant. Messes. Like, I, I couldn't kill Lawrence. Tonight, Gammon joins the hunt. Is there, like, anything else in this game that's fire resistant apart from Lawrence, though? fight buddy old hunter smart 
<laughs> I just killed him in three viscerals. Defiled Watchdog BL4 tape torch takes four hours <laughs> with fast rats. Yeah, that that doesn't sound very fun. It'd be really cool if you could put gems in the torch, like change it to arcane or like a bolt torch or something. <laughs> good weapon. I mean, it only has one attack. I don't know if I'd call it a crazy good weapon. <laughs> what the hell is going on? Two claw mark runes. <laughs> you can unlock gem slots with the yeah. You can do a lot of stuff with the save editor. Okay, I've been streaming for like way cold? too long today. Working nine hours. <clears throat> oh, good hunter. Nine hours of Bloodborne. <laughs> that was a lot of farming. That was fun though. At least we got some uh some like meme runs set up and stuff for uh for the future runs. And yeah, I'll be sure to let you guys know about the the viewer runs soon, like if I'm gonna